Alrighty, Outdoor Office family, we're going to show you how to install a toilet. First off, you got to take your old toilet out. You got your tank bolts, you got to take out in the bottom, get that out of the way, makes it a little bit lighter. Then you got your flange bolts here at the bottom of your floor, two of them on both sides. And then underneath that, you're going to have your wax ring. So we're going to show you all this, how it goes, and but first, tank comes off first. One quick thing we didn't tell you is your shutoff valve needs to be off. We didn't forget to turn it off, but it needs to be off. So tank bolts are loose. All right, who's going to get the tank bolts or who's going to take the tank out? All right, come get it. Who, me? Somebody. Me? Get the tank off? Yep, lift it off. Nope, I, I will. I will. All right. I will. Too heavy. Okay. All right. Here goes Caleb. Hold up. Hold up. You're still Why hooked is it up. Connected? <laughs> is it connected? Is it disconnected? Oh. Water coming out. All right. That's fine. Yeah, no dip. Here's a little tail. A little towel. Oh. Sorry. There we All go. right. That's just water, son. Water. It's not. It's not All poopy right. water. All right. right. Where are we going? Yeah. Going out to the garage. Good job, bud. Isaac, I want you to go down here and take off these little caps here. That's your flange bolts that hold the toilet to the floor. All right. So we're going to take those off now. Sorry. He locked Caleb out in the garage. <laughs> it's not cool. So take your screwdriver okay. and pop those little caps off mm -hmm. and find out what size wrench you need. All right, Caleb found out that it's a 9 16 wrench for our flange bolts. So it's he a little is, bit bigger than one half. Which is 9 16 buddy. Yeah. And then take those loose and then do the other side. And then you know what you get to do together as a team? What is it? Lift the whole bowl out of there. Whole entire thing? Whole entire thing. All right, Isaac, do the other side. All right, Caleb and Isaac have got the tank bolts or flange bolts off. I have to try to get this. Come and on, Caleb. Now they're going to lift it out of here. Whoa! It's it's got water in it. I water. told you it'd have water in it. Go. Now, Mom is going to come in here and go. Ooh, that's gross. Well, what we're going to do now is clean all this up while it's out and. Get ready to install the new one. Isaac is going to take up the old wax ring. See this wax ring right here? You got to pull. I just want to be able to clean the floor. All right, go ahead and grab that wax ring, Isaac. Oh, Dad? Yep. It's probably going to come apart. It's going to be smushy and all that. So go ahead. Pick it up. Oh, that's the... Oh, can I? Yeah, you can. No, I can't! Yes, you can. Uh, uh, uh. Let me try it. Yeah, that's an old wax ring. Can't. Yeah, you can. No, I can't! Get both hands in it. Let's go. Why do I All have right. to do this? We're going we're gonna to take the wax ring See, off so we can read today or no? a new one. Get yeah, here, get Caleb. in here, Caleb. Come on. Yeah. Get in here. Save the day. Pull up the wax wait. ring. This don't, don't touch things. It's this in one. my other hand. Oh, what is that? I told you it's a wax what ring. What the? What is that? I can't pick it up. It's like get the screwdriver. Yeah. There's wait, wait. wait. Don't and touch things. What is that? <laughs> oh no. Okay. Yeah. See. I can't it's get it. it's in there hard. All right, I'm gonna have to show these boys how to get the wax ring off. All right, we're cleaned up. I'm gonna do some more, but the wax ring is off. So now we gotta go outside, get the new toilet, and uh, get our wax ring in here. We're gonna change our supply hose to stainless braided. So this is gonna look a lot better when we're done. All right, we're out in the garage. We got the American Standard champion four uh, it's in white uh, the champion four and the bone color or the off-white 
was like another 90 bucks. And I was like, nah, we'll go with the white. But here's what we got. White's just fine. The boys already have the tank in and the lid in. Now they're going to have to get the bowl out, but they're going to have to have some help. Here's your lid or wax your seat ring. and your lid. Your wax rings in the bottom box here. We got some uh, flange this, bolts that then? we're going to be using. Huh? I'll show you here in just a minute. So let's get this opened up and get everything down ready to go. All right, we got our caps for our flange bolts. We got our nuts and they mm -hmm. actually have a wrench in this thing, a plastic wrench to do it all with. But there's your ring, there's your uh, the tank to bowl part. seal. It's this thing right here. <laughs> that right there? Well, right you're right. installing it. So let's get all this inside and get everything down. All right, Caleb's going to show you how to install the wax ring here. Whoa! Here, do me, do it. No, please. All right. See your flange part here? Yeah. That goes down. down. Okay. And your Why do they want it to be wax? And your bowl. You just made a plastic. Well, because that helps seal it. Because when you tighten it down, this mashes down and creates a seal. Oh. So put your wax ring in there. Yeah. You want it to be centered. You want to center it as much like as you there. can. Let me see. Like that? Yep. Like I, I did it. That looks pretty good. All right. Boom, now up. let's go get the bowl. This is going to be the hard part. How heavy is this? Bowl's installed. Now what I'm going to have the boys do is put on the flange bolts and show them the proper way how to tighten the toilet down. So it comes down evenly and we don't have any leaks. That is our main goal here. Now we have our, our flange nuts. Mm -hmm. You know what these are here? Mm -hmm. These are to put over your threads first. You just slide them right down on top, mm -hmm. okay? They act as a washer. Then you put your bolts on, okay? Mm -hmm. And then you have your own, mate, your own wrench. So what you'll do, Isaac, is you'll get yours hand snug, mm -hmm. Caleb will get his hand snug, and then mm -hmm. you'll do two turns, Caleb will do two turns. And go back and forth mm -hmm. until we're tight. So let's get that started. Push it straight down on top. It'll snap all the way down. Make sure your bolt's straight though. All right. No. Good. Here's your, here's your nut. nut. Caleb, here's yours. Step over to the other side and Caleb will get his right over here. Ooh. All right, so Isaac put four on his side. So. It's not too big, Caleb. So it's a half inch instead of nine sixteenths? Yeah. Yeah, it's a half inch. All right. Alright, that one's in. Okay, tighten them together now. Put them on there and go down together. Alright? One, one, two, three. I can't twist mine no more. Mine's like, I can't twist mine no more. Alright. Is yours good? Keep going. And if you listen, you can hear the rain mush. Listen. Hear it? Is that good? Yeah, that's good. Okay, good. All right, I, Isaac, you're too much on your side. Caleb needs to tighten his side now. Gosh dang it, Isaac. All right, we're almost done. This right here. All right, we're good and tight. Caps are on. Here. Now we're going to put the tank. You have your tank to bowl gasket that goes right there. And then, the and then we're going to set the tank on top of it. Is that thing getting heavy, Caleb? All right, let's get it set on top here. Mm. Go ahead, bud. Gotta get your bolt holes lined up. All right, Isaac, I need your help on the other side to line up the holes. Okay. This is called Homeschooling 101. <laughs> Learning how to install a toilet. All right, what? I'll help you get them lined up, guys. I have a problem. What's that? Oh. You got to reach up in there. Yeah, up under there. 
what, you got to use both hands to get under on this one. Boy, so we're almost done. The boys are putting the tank bolts in. I and can't get down they, there. Buddy, if I can get down there to do it, I know you can. So. I got mine on. All right. They're going to get the tank bolts on here. We'll bring it down all together in one shot. And then we'll be doing the supply line. All right. What we got now, tank is done. I had the boys alternate back and forth three or four turns from underneath with the wrench. Uh, Isaac needed a towel down here to lay down to get in the corner. So now they're going to show you how right, you to, to go get in the corner install again. the seat with these, like, little and lid. Things. All right. So obviously those unscrew. Neat. All right. Now you put them down through. Down there. Open holes there. Close the cap. Nope, 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 nope. Because like you got to be able to hold on to it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure it doesn't fall off. Yeah. And then you got to make sure the lid and the seat is squared up with the bowl itself, okay? tight are you putting them on the right way yeah all right i think i am yeah because mine's going right so let's show them what to do once we get done here okay all right if you're looking under here you can see that little piece that comes off the side of the bolt that's like a bolt stop that allows you to tighten everything up here from the top side once you get it started so i just tighten this to finish tightening that okay now what do we got to do on this, uh, the caps there? Let's close it. All right, just close Take them down. Mine. All right. Now, when you're putting on your seat, you want to make sure it's good and flush all the way around. It's not too far front, forward, back, all that good well, stuff. And then there's like this plastic. we'll take that plastic off. Can I even get it? <laughs> That's why our next, I take your gloves off. We are going to do our supply line here, get it installed, and we will be done. We'll turn on the water and make sure there's no leaks. Fingers crossed. Okay, so we gotta um undo this. What what are you undoing it from? Right here. The water. The your, water supply? This is called your water supply or your main supply valve or shutoff okay, valve. I can't do this. All right, we'll see if it's loose enough to where you can take it off by hand. Yep. All right. Let's keep the thing in place. Okay. We have a 16 right. inch toilet thing. So Isaac will finish this one up. Caleb will show you how to install your new hose. Well, after some technical difficulties of getting the old one off. Well, you got to make sure that one's tight. Yes, yeah, so you have to get down here at the turn right. Righty tighty, lefty loosey. Righty tighty, lefty like loosey. Channel locks. Get it on there. It's a tightness. Just like this. Can I get that lined up? I think that's tightness. Let's see if I can tighten some of it by hand. All right, where's your other end go, bud? Up, on your, right here, right this thing right okay, here. Okay, so that's your, do you remember what that valve is called for your toilet? Uh, your water valve. That's your fill valve or float valve right there, okay? I said water valve because it's clean water too. Yeah. Don't turn the hose away from you too much. Come on. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, let's get it hooked up to the supply. So Caleb's getting it hooked up to the supply. Keep going. Hopefully there's no leaks. All the way. Yeah. Yeah. More. Yeah. Yeah. Dad, I'm gonna go All right, do you think that's good? Yeah, I think so. All right. Yeah. 
Let's turn on the water and see what happens. All right. Oh! We got water. It's going in! All right. Now let's turn it off and make sure we don't have any leaks anywhere. So let, let about two or three inches get in there and then we'll turn it off. Make sure we don't have any leaks. So go ahead and turn off the main supply. All right, so far no leaks. Which is so what we're going to do is we're going to let to make sure our float is at the proper height. And then we will flush it one time to purge the bowl. Get water in our trap so we don't get sewer gas back up through. And we'll show you when it's operational. All right. Oh, it's water in there. Yeah. All right, you ready? Yeah, it's at the right height. The first flush. Go ahead. No leaks. All right, well, we don't know yet. We haven't checked around the edge of the floor. So we'll see once this gets filled back up to see if we have any leaks. If no leaks, we'll put the lid on it, and we will call this one D-O-N-E. Done. Put a fork in it because we're done. Uh, who wants to do the victory dance, guys? What's left? Nothing. Yes. Isaac William. <laughs> you just found it. All right. And we can call this a home economics. <laughs> no, not home economics. Home this, 101. this is um, homeschooling 101. Done. How to install a toilet. Good job, boys. Hey, Outdoor Office family, keep following us for more because we're going to come at you with a lot of stuff, right? Yeah. All right. Always remember. No matter what the season, we got you on our sides. You got that right. Y'all be good.